Hello ladies, welcome back to my channel and today I'll be doing an amazing review of this um, very hard to come by Chanel uh, Jumbo XL vintage bag and there actually it is. It is stunning, very very rare piece and um, the hardware is 24k plated um the condition of this bag has never been um like redone or uh touched or fully dyed and the leather is still like so buttery and soft and honestly i have not touched anything like this um from the um, from their new releases so when people say that the leather on the vintage bags was better quality there's a reason for that and um, I find out doing my research actually I read that on Zico's channel on on Instagram um, she said that uh, which I agree with that the cows at the time that the vintage flaps that were produced you know there were less GMO products and the cows that were grass fed it and um, this is the reason why the leather is more softer you know more buttery and i mean if, if you compare this to the newest bags you're not going to be able to find such like smooth and nice quality of the leather even though chanel still i mean some people still say some people say now chanel you know it doesn't have the same quality as they used to before i don't agree with that i think their flaps are fabulous you know some have like minor flaws but i mean there is a reason you can always choose you can always exchange you can always you know bring your back for the repair if something happens because hey you know it's just back at the end of the day you know it's not made out of steel um so regarding this bag uh, i mean obviously it is a large it is a large flap on five six but i mean i absolutely adore this it's just i mean it's just so pretty and the large logo i mean it, it's for win you know honestly it wins my heart and it's just so pretty so um this is single flap we twist this and we open the flap. We open the flap to one big compartment over here. And then there's also one compartment with a zip. This bag comes with a card and a little booklet. It's, I'm sorry, uh, I didn't mention this uh, at the beginning. It's been sold already, um, but um, yeah, it comes with a holo. Holo is partially readable. It has a card, a uh, dust bag and a box. I mean, for this bag to have honestly a card, it it's it's a big deal, you know, because it's 1991, and I mean, the bag is 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 pretty old, and the owner cared enough, you know, just to keep the full set, and I mean, it, I think it's pretty amazing. So, uh, yes, it's just two compartments here, more for like a card or for something like th that is. Uh, very flat um and then there's one big compartment over here um i highly highly recommend you to authenticate your bag if you are buying from the reseller if you're buying from ebay then most of the cases you cover because you go into authenticator but if you are buying uh from the reseller and especially it's a vintage item authenticate it because trust me there's tons of replicas and these bags they cost pretty much the same as the new ones. Um, so you can also wear this on the, let me show you, on the single um, on the single flap, but I just don't think that, you know, it's a way to go because strap is way too, um, it's, it's, it's just way too, uh, you know, you can't even see this. <laughs> it's just, it's almost in my knees area, but yeah. Uh, I mean, this bag definitely meant to be worn on the double chain. I just, I just uh, stain my jacket with the lipstick. Oh, I'm a master of making mess. I'm, I'm probably the champion of the world. Anyway, going back to this. So Chanel stopped making, uh, Chanel stopped making um, 24K 
plated hardware, gold plate hardware in 2008. So all bags that has been produced after 2008, they don't have any um, uh, plated, um, you know, gold plated hardware. Prior, yes. Uh, so this is one of the gems that obviously was made before 2008 and it has a gold plated hardware um, and I mean this bag is just I mean it's in fabulous condition and the fact that it has not been touched up it's just it's for a win you know because mostly vintage bags they're just colored or recolored unless you find one that is in pristine condition this one's close to the pristine condition it's in fabulous condition and it's just i mean the back is is beautiful i love it so much you know i i wish i wish i could keep it but unfortunately i cannot um i want to show you also the difference between this one and the regular uh maxi that they are producing now maxi bag and also a uh, jumbo because this is jumbo xl this is, this is like a moxie bag let me just see if this trap that's even yeah it's all good so give me one. Okay, i happen to have this one also in the ready stock and uh let me just show you so this one um this one uh, this one actually it's available ladies so if you're looking for a handbag that, um, you know, it, this one is uh, um, uh, a single flap, Maxi in caviar with silver hardware, way below the retail. So if you're interested, you can follow me on Instagram and I'll be able to answer all your questions and sell your handbag, of course. But um, so yeah, there you go. I feel like that uh, the vintage one, it's skinnier. No, I don't feel like, I mean, it's true. It is, it is skinnier, um, like, you know, in this, in, uh, on the sides, because this one, ha it, it's more like wider. Uh, but other than that, um, as you can see, I mean, the shape is different, the flap is different. They have a pocket on the back. So, um, you know, that is something that they have in coming and the double chain strap and the single flap also, but uh, obviously two different styles. Um, if I can vote, I would definitely vote for this one, for them to bring it back because of the large, amazing, beautiful logo. I mean, they don't make this anymore, but I mean, logo is definitely for the win. Fabulous, just fabulous piece. So ladies, if you happen to have fine, if you happen to want one, you know, either this one or this one or any honestly other ones, contact me and I'll be able to help you to find your dream bag. All the bags that goes through me, um, they're 100% authentic. I make sure regarding authenticity. Like I always say to my clients, I'll never put client in a position that they have to question authenticity. Now, if you want to double authenticate it, if you want to send it to authenticator, like I absolutely don't mind, you know, I, I guarantee that 1 million percent. So, ladies, uh, that was a review for today. Uh, oh, no, 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 wait a second, wait a second. And I also wanted to show you the difference between this one and the Jumbo. Um, this one is so pretty too. So, this is Jumbo new release this is vintage one so you can see that they're pretty much like the same size this one the, the vintage one xl it's a little bit bigger but definitely the vintage xl it's more it's closer to the jumbo size than to maxi um you know newest release um so there you go I mean, both are fabulous. I love, I'm a jumbo girl. You know, I'm not a medium girl, I'm a jumbo girl. I love jumbo. I feel like it's one of the best bags that Chanel ever made. If, and if you are my height, which I'm 5'6", uh, you definitely have to look into the jumbo bag. If you are between medium and a jumbo, I highly suggest you to stick with the jumbo. You're gonna be happy with it. It's a bag like they will last you for decades. I'm not saying medium one, but I just feel like medium is small bag for me. So this one, it's just a right. 
Um, all right, ladies. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll be back soon with another release. I have a Birkin coming. I did a video on the Birkin already. Um, I have coming 35 in orange. So I'll do the review on that bag and um, I'll give you pros and cons. And uh, I mean, I just have so many of them. So uh, just continue subscribing to my channel and I promise you, I'm gonna keep you entertained. Bye.